All right, welcome back. Okay, there's a couple of ways that you could do this. You could basically just add the plum sauce and the soy directly into the uh, the chops in the saute pan. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you a technique that we call tempering in the business. Uh, I'm just going to get myself a whisk. So many tools, so little time. <laughs> Give me this one. Okay, where are my whisks? I guess this little guy will have to do. Oh, that's right, I moved it. I forgot to say, I expanded the kitchen. I moved things around a little bit. So now I have stuff in different places, all my different devices and stuff. So, okay. Now, tempering is very simple. You start with one base liquid. This is a sweet plum sauce that I'm putting in now. Then, what we're going to do is, i got to put the camera down for this. Okay, let's put it here so you can see. Now, a little at a time, I'm going to add some soy, and I'm going to temper it into the, the plum sauce. So, I don't want to put too much because I don't want to take out that full sweetness, but I also definitely do not want so much sweetness that it's going to be overbearing. Now, remember, soy sauce is like a liquid salt. So... I want to go easy with both of them, but what I'm doing is tempering it in so that both flavors combine and you get an even flavor. See the difference in the color of what went in to what it is now? Alright. So that's basically the idea of tempering before adding your sauce. Okay. Got my chops going. I'm going to add the sauce directly in. Go right over the chops so that they get a nice glaze going. Nice. So that's a sweet plum and soy combination, which is going to be rather beautiful. Now, I'd like to give a big shout out to Jerry and his wonderful wife for giving me some fresh oregano. I'm going to hit this with some fresh oregano towards the end so we get all the aromatic thing going on. And um, I'm going to come back in the next episode, chop it up real quick for you, and then we'll plate it for you. Okay, guys, see you in the last one. Thanks.